Hello everyone, this is Alex Deffen and in today's video I'm gonna meet a full guide of Granhilda how to build her, how to play her, and how to get her so yeah now before we start the video please do subscribe to my channel Put a notification on and comment down below what your favorite character bound us to. And please do not forget to follow me on twitch.tv slash alexdeffen. Now let's begin. Now people would want to know how to get her. Now there's two ways to get her. First one is the most easiest step is to summon her right now she is on the banner and um her weapon as well for now she's on the banner for approximately two uh two weeks that's the first step the second step is from the pub now there is a chance she will be there or not as you can see that the pub have like a recruit every two hours is to refresh and so that how you know if she's gonna be here or not there's a small chance it's very rare but some people did have her and it's like 0.4 percent chance of probability so that's the first thing if you are enjoying the content so far please do subscribe to my youtube channel and put the notification bell on that would be helpful and please do follow me on twitch.tv slash alexdeffen now people would want to know how her skill works and so i'm gonna tell you how she works one note i'm gonna have to tell you is i'm not gonna talk about grand hilder idol because they work quite a bit different in a way so this one is only for the void costume so let's get started so as you can see the void costume of grand Hilder basically work with basically you need to get hit and she will counter 200 percent of the received damage three time by the way so it's only three time hit for that skill which is not really really quite a lot and i would say that it's quite good depending on the situation i'm gonna talk about those situations a bit later on now for the gear i know that in uh, Grand Hilda Idol, she's gonna need a lot of defense in terms of PvP and stuff. But for the Void one, it's quite different. Because the more defense you get, the less damage she takes and the less damage she will counter. Because remember, her costume counters the received damage by 200%. The, less, the more defense you have, the less damage she takes. And so you have to put that in mind. So I'm gonna show you an example with 42% defense with and with less defense like 8% defense and you guys gonna compare it with. To show you the difference, the more the enemy hit you hard, the more she will counter the attack hit. Let's attack um, this, uh, whatever name is. Here. By the way, when you do the preemptive, she will automatically use it and you can attack at the same time. Yeah. Now, let's see. So, 
So as you can see, she will deal a bit more damage. But sadly, it's only two time, which is not uh, the best thing out there. She might not need defense if you want to do more high damage. So let me, what if I remove all those defense? Now you only have 8%. Let's see. Okay, my, my HP is a bit lower, but what would happen? Maybe you don't really need defense, so let's see. Well, then because she countered uh, that, she was countered. And so, let's see now what would happen. Okay, let's do the battle. She died 190, so it's not a lot of damage. So, yeah, as you can see. So as you can see, with those deep and uh, damage will be reduced. And so now I'm gonna tell you how to build her. So how to build her? Now I know for a fact that defense gonna be kind of a bit of a minority trouble here. But if I were to me, the best way to build her is to get a speed and a bit of different percentage. I know for a fact that Grand Hill do need to tank a lot of the damage, but at the same time, she need a lot damage to uh, to uh, reflect back to the enemy. So in my opinion, the best way to have her is a speed percentage, a bit of defense percentage, and a lot of crit damage. So I, uh, like you saw, uh, did see in the, the in the previous video that I made on the different comparison, when she did crit damage, she was uh, she did almost four thousand. So having crit damage percent would help her a lot to do a lot more damage, but at the same time, she gonna need a buffer with her. As for the buffer, I would suggest you maybe use Combat Idol Yuri. She will, she will help her a lot to do a lot of damage. And if, if you have a plus 5 costume uh, Combat Yuri, she will do insane amount of damage without crit. But I'm pretty sure with crit damage, she might be doing a bit more. So I don't have sadly you Combat Yuri, but... I heard from people saying that she might be good, so I trust my source. Okay, well, never mind this one, but she, Diana costume give her a lot of crit rate. And Arine too. Whoopsie. So, yeah, Arine as well give uh, a lot of crit rate, 30% crit rate. So, both her and also diana may work well with her and she need a decent crit damage means uh yeah she need decent crit damage to do a lot of damage on her counter she is very good in the pvp and in the pve she can be good she basically is situational i get in pve so it depends on the enemy and so I don't know 
because then again it depends on how the enemy enemy hit hard or not so be careful about that so the only thing to build her with is a speed percentage don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and put a notification bell if you are enjoying this content please do follow me on twitch.tv slash alec that would be great Thank you very much, we will see you next time. Bye bye!